Yo, so today we're gonna check out our con pickups and smart con. So let's get into it. Yo, everybody, what's up? It's your boy Duke. This is Pop Supreme. Yep, and so SDCC, the virtual con. It was a horrible mess. It was terrible. Um, everybody was stuck in line for hours. I mean, I was literally in line for an hour and 20 minutes and then everything was sold out. I mean, it was horrible. So we had to go through alternative motives, alternative means to find what we wanted to find. We didn't get everything, but we found a couple pieces. We found this piece here. It's the uh, Super Tails and uh, Silver, uh, Super Silver. This was the GameStop exclusive. This doesn't have the sticker. It has the GameStop sticker. That's kind of weird, but it just came with this GameStop sticker. I mean, hey, I'll take it. They're not having it at all, but I picked this bad boy up, and it was the last one I was able to find. I mean, I'm lucky I found this one, to be quite honest with you. I already see them selling online for like 60 bucks, which is like price gouging. It's crazy. Um, and I think just because of how the con was, and like how hard it was and how screwed up everything was. I think these pops from this year's con are gonna go up significantly than other years or past years or whatnot. Even commons are probably keep their value around 30, 20, 30 bucks. So that's pretty cool. So that was our first piece. And then we got, boom, Katsubaku go. So we ended up getting this bad boy and this bad boy, which I'm, I'm happy with just these two. I also wanted the Aliens Remix from Box Lunch. I went there and online, they're like 50 bucks already right now. I'm not gonna pay that, that's crazy. I'll just wait it out and see what happens and maybe get something to trade out later on, who knows. But um, I'm really stoked about this get bad boy right here, uh, My Hero Academia. The last, what is it, Ochoco? She's like at 400 bucks, bro, it's like crazy, so. If this goes way that did, it, it'll probably go to about 200 bucks or so. So, I mean, even now it's like 80 to 100 something dollars. It's crazy. So I ended up getting these two, which is a pretty, pretty good ones, I think, for how bad the con was and how just hectic everything's been. So these two are my pickups. But um, on top of that, we got a SmyCon box, mystery box, woo woo. So this was a SmyCon. Um, they did this the week before um, the Comic Con um, Virtual Con, should I say, came out. And this one was the SmyCon The Middle Ground Showdown Mystery Box. This was $65 a box, minimum value of $55. So, I mean, you're basically going to get your money back out of this. Smy is known for doing pretty well. So, if I had a guess before I even opened this bad boy up, I'm guessing around $75, $80 range. That's where they normally shoot at. That's the sweet spot. Um, but the reason I went with this one was because they had the 1 in 24, the gold gambit was randomly inserted in only the middle ground boxes. So, that was the reasoning behind me buying the middle ground box. Um, yeah, and 1 out of 6 is over 100 PPG. So, yeah, we'll see what we get. The top hit, the top pulls, bah, bah, were Sloth. He was 160. The Sloth box is worth 225 PPG. And I'm going to post pictures um, so you guys can kind of see what, what came with it. So it'll be here somewhere. So, yeah, check that out. Um, also, I'm going to post a link for my uh, for my other uh, my boxes that I bought. You know what I mean? Pass. I only done like two or three smile boxes, so this is probably my second or third one. So I'll go ahead and add that um, above as well. So we'll go ahead and put those to the side. And we're going to get into cracking this bad boy. So you know how I like to start my things off with that positive vibes. You know what I mean? That good juju. Hopefully we get something good. Even if not, you know what I mean? It's smile. You can't lose a smile, right? So we're here with that positive vibes and good juju. And we're going to start cracking. Bam! And I'm gonna turn it because I don't have boxes. Normally they do not. But nope, no boxes. So they're in bubble wrap. There's one, two, there's three of them. And we're gonna fill around. 
One's in a protector. This one's not in a protector. Let's just take the one not in a protector first. And this. Ah. Yes. Batgirl. Nice. So this is the classic series Batman. I think these were uh, done a year or two ago, not too long ago, but I think this was bolted, to be honest with you. Um, it's pretty good, Batgirl. I don't click Batman, Batman or DC as much, but I like Marvel more than DC. I'm a Marvel guy. I know when I was growing up, I clicked a lot of Marvel cards and stuff. I was really never into the DC, but Batman is really cool. So Batgirl, eh, not too shabby. But hey, still got some sweetness in here. All right, so I'm gonna save the soft. I got a soft protector, so not a hard protector. That tells us we didn't get top cool. And let me see. Uh, oh, one. Oh, let's pull this one out. Help it. All right. So this is it. Bam. Doctor Who, eleventh Doctor. Well, lots. And I'm going to be posting the pictures. This isn't too shabby. I mean, I don't know about Doctor Who. I know it's like a British television show from back in the day. They have one through like 52 Doctors. Um, but this is the B BGVtoys.com exclusive. And it's a soft protector. And it has a beautiful little smile thing on top. That's pretty cool. So, that's our second one. First one, second one. This is an exclusive. That's pretty cool. So, last, last one. Gonna go ahead and get the crack in it. Let's see if we got that goodness. Um, I'm trying to see which way to do it. Back there, there's something. Lots. Walking Dead. The RV Walker. This is the older one. This is vaulted. This is um, I think like the first or second series. I believe this is uh pretty cool to be honest with you. Um, I like this one. To be honest, I like this one more than this one because I like Watching Dead. I mean Walking Dead. I really started watching it again like about two or three days ago. What a coincidence, huh? Nuts. All right, so. We got two soft protectors and a no protector in the Smicon box. This is the $60, $65 um, Battleground Mystery Box. If I had a guess price-wise, I would just lay them just in this order, to be quite frank. First, second, third. Um, just because I think the coolness of this one, to be honest, I, I don't know the values. But, I mean, this one does have a chance to be a little higher. So, huh, who knows? But if I had a guess, it's first, second, third. So that's our SmiteCon pickup, and this right here is our Virtual Cons SDCC pickup. I think we did pretty well, not too shabby. We still want to get the Remix Alien because that would be freaking dope if we did. Um, and maybe um, I need that Jack in the Box. I do add icons as you can tell, so I need the Jack in the Box. I might have to pay for it, but I need him. Well, there it is there. So not too bad on the SmiteCon, not too bad on the Virtual Con or SDCC, whatever. But hey, it's your boy Duke. I'm going to ask you guys to help me out. Subscribe, won't you? Check me out. We're trying to get to 500. Like, comment, subscribe. It's your boy Duke. We're out.